is going on guys it's Brandon Jay and oh my gosh is it good to finally be back home sweet home down here in Florida if you guys have been tuned into the channel you know I've been in Hawaii for like a month and a half I've created some crazy content out there but it is good to be back home and funny enough we're actually on our way down to like more southern Florida however uh, our hotel kind of we got mixed up and we ended up not being able to get into our hotel so we went to get another hotel but it was booked it was in the middle of nowhere basically we were stranded me jake and tristan we slept in our trucks i slept on the back of my jet ski for a while and basically i haven't had like any sleep and don't let my energy right now fool you because it is all thanks to red bull by the way it's not sponsored but red bull if you want to sponsor it hit me up because that would be an amazing sponsor. I say that to say this, we didn't even plan on filming today, but since we were stranded and we were close to one of our favorite springs here in Florida, we decided why not make the most of our time, come out here, do a video for you guys, it's more content. So today, Jake and Tristan are actually going down the Santa Fe River looking for a river treasure in like the murky water. I didn't personally want to do that. And plus, I recently just bought this dope metal detector, so I kind of want to like take advantage of it. So I'm going to hop in the nice clear springs and hop in the dirty water like they are and see if I can find anything that was lost here today. So real quick, before we begin actually searching for treasure, I want to break down my gear for you guys so you kind of like know what's going on while I'm actually finding things underwater. I'm going to be using a scuba tank today, so basically I can stay underwater longer, allow me to like really dig in if I find something. Um, how this works is this is my space gun dental detector is what I like to call it. Metal detector for those of you who didn't get the joke there. And basically this thing's waterproof and it has headphones. I'm going to be wearing the headphones like a uh, underwater DJ. And basically it's going to peak in sound whenever it hears any metal that's under the water. Once I hear something like that, I'm going to pull out this device. This is basically a pinpointer. So it's going to vibrate and flash. It's going to pinpoint it for me. I'm going to waft away the sand and basically uncover whatever is actually lost under the sand, rock, whatever it's lost under, and hopefully I can find something really cool. One thing I forgot to mention is we are not just searching one spot today. What we're gonna be doing is just like a really quick, brief search of a bunch of different spots because basically Jake and Tristan are making their way down the river as we speak. So we're kind of running against the clock here. I wanna be done before they're done so we can get up out of here because we do actually have to go to our hotel today. I'm gonna go ahead and get the dental detector, the scuba tank, and the pinpointer all together, hop in the water, see what I can find today. Well got all my gear right here. I'm gonna go ahead and hop in the water, see what I can find. Should be a good time, I'm really excited. I think we can get something really good today.
<laughs> I had to do it. <laughs> I had to do it. I'm so sorry, man. <laughs> man, I don't know if they know I'm here. I was like, let me touch his foot. We saw you. We're like, he's gonna have to move. I was stuck in a little spot, man. Just digging. <laughs> that is so funny. All right guys, so this is everything we actually found right here. Uh, we got a bunch of bottle cap tops or beer bottle tops pretty much. Uh, but my favorite find so far has to be like this little lock. It's honestly a cool little lock. I don't know what it would have been used for. Uh, let me know in the comment section below if you guys know maybe what that could have been on. And guys, my metal detector is paying for itself. We've got, oh gosh, I just lost five cents. Well, we uh, have 35 cents. We used to have 40 cents, but I think I just lost <laughs> lost five cents under the freaking deck. Dang it. Anyway, it was really fun searching here. Let's get to the next spot. And now it's time for us to get into Black Bay and uh, go to our next spot. Oh my gosh. I'm telling you guys, this YouTube stuff, it's exhausting. Maybe it's not YouTube stuff. Maybe it's just diving stuff. <laughs> this is, I I took a road I've never seen before and I don't know why I thought that was a smart idea. All right, we're, we're taking another road we've never seen before now. All right, we're gonna get there, I hope. Oh yeah. All right, made it. Oh gosh, I didn't take my seatbelt. <laughs> That's so embarrassing. <laughs> made it to spot number two. I'm gonna show you this uh, spot and then we're gonna go explore. I'm John. John? Yeah. It's so awesome, man. Nice I just walked you. up. He was yeah. like, dude, do you make YouTube videos? I was like, man, you caught me. So you got, you watched them yeah, this morning? Absolutely. That is so awesome. Fanatic, so That's yeah. so awesome, man. Are you guys from here? I'm from Gainesville. Oh, super yeah. cool, man. Michigan? Yeah. Oh, man, you should be used to the cold, bro. <laughs> you should be used to it. That's super cool. Well, this is spot number two. Uh, it's a really cool spot. It's like a bunch of sand bottom. There's like a cavern over in here. So we're going to get the uh, scuba gear, hop on in, see what we can find there. It's a pretty popular location, as you can see. There's quite a few people here. So unlike the first spot that was completely dead, no people there, this one, uh, hopefully we can find something good here. And can we just take one minute to admire Black Bay? I've been gone in Hawaii for like a month and a half. I was driving a Jeep and I missed this truck so bad. I turned, this is my very first truck and I turned it into like the ultimate travel, travel, travel mobile. I got my scuba tank that just fell out there. I'm gonna put this thing on and hop in. This place is so beautiful, you guys are about to see.
All right guys, so I just hopped out of the water. I had a free diver come down and get me because I apparently Tristan like waved him over I my was like, way. Hey, I need you to get him. <laughs> yeah, he, he came down and I was like, oh, you want to be part of the video? Like I was like over there throwing sand at fish. I was like, he's chilling with me. He was like, I was like, oh man, I'm in trouble now. And then I saw it was you. Yeah. So I came over, but oh, uh, boy, oh boy. You got something? Dude. Hold on, hold it's, on. It's, it's something. I don't have it on me because I left it at the boat ramp, but. I'm about to have to go and get the truck. All right, well, what is it, what is it? <laughs> I can't wait Bro, anymore. Bro, probably the best find that we've ever found, and I found a freaking Rolex. No, you did not. <laughs> a real one? It's not fake or anything? Dude, there's diamonds in it and everything. You gotta be kidding Dude, me. Dude, it's legit. You know what, I'm really freaking happy for him. I'm not sure when he's like actually gonna get that video up or whatever, I'm not sure. Uh, but if you guys want to see that, head over to Tristan's channel. I mean, that's a huge find, a freaking Rolex. So I guess I'm not going to be able to go to spot number three, kind of like I wanted to. But spot number two is really freaking cool, man. I had a blast in there. And it seemed like every five seconds, my metal detector was going off. So I found a bunch of change. I'm going to go ahead and show you my finds. But uh, I love this spot. I, I wish we could go to like spot number three, four, and five. Um, if you guys want to see those... I'll uh, make some time and hit this on my way back up out of Florida. Uh, but drop a thumbs up or let me know in the comment section below if like stuff like this is what you want to see more of. All right, so basically we're going to be rich. <laughs> we got 50 cents, 60 cents, 70 cents, 75 cents, 76, 77, 78, 79, and a beer top. <laughs> I honestly don't remember how much I found in the first spot, but I've got... Honestly, just forgot how much I just counted out here, but I don't even have a dollar, I don't think. But uh, anyway, that is pretty much all I found for today. If you enjoyed today's video, make sure you drop a big old thumbs up. And like I said, if you want to see me go to the next few spots um, and dead old Demek those as well, let me know in the comment section below. All right, that's going to pretty much wrap it up. Got to hop into Black Bay. Well, got to hop out of the wet clothes, get a shower, clean up, then get in Black Bay, then hopefully get in our hotel so we don't have to sleep in the parking lot again. Thank you guys so much for watching, and as always, I'll catch you guys on the next adventure. Peace out. Been a little too nice to y'all. Now I got a price for y'all. Snake eyes on dice for y'all. Shoulders on ice for y'all.